Welcome to Pavitra Laptop Care. Today I have reviewed a laptop. It's from HP. The model number is where it is 15 iPhone CX 0140 TX. Okay. Hmm. Actually, customer told it's a dead. Okay. Let me check what will be the issue. First, I will try with DC machine. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. DC is not taking. See. DC is not supporting. Hmm. Anyway, I'll check with original adapter, which customer has given. So original adapter. I don't know what is the difference. Your length will be the difference little bit. Okay. Anyway, original adapter. I'm connecting. Yeah, light has come. See, okay. it means three five volts. Maybe okay. Now let's power on. Done. Hmm. Once again, power on, gun. No, oh, what will be the issue? Let me check. See, customer has given somewhere. Hmm. First point. It means before R and D has done. I think so because of the sticker. I'm telling. Hmm. Customer didn't tell anything. Oh, uh, whatever it may be, if we are a technician, definitely we need to sort it out. That point we should be keep it in our mind. Hmm? Okay, let me check. I am opening the laptop. What will be the reason? Uh, one of the gaming laptop from HP Pavilion. the motherboard part number that i will show you this is motherboard hmm model number is here given product la iphone f 841 p The model number. Okay. Uh, see, by seeing only we can tell this bias work has done. That much of clarity won't be there. Anyway, bias work has done. Anything um, else? I have written already. Okay, I will open the motherboard from the case. Hmm. Here is the motherboard. Okay. Now I have opened. Now I will use the DC. Now we will check for the result. That time DC didn't work. Now I will check. Now DC is working. Okay. Now DC is working zero zero nine. Okay, zero point zero zero nine. Hmm. Anyway, uh, here is the power button. Hmm. I will turn it on. Light glows, but what about the amp? Fifteen. Light off. Okay. Now again. Show you. This is nine. Mm. No, on. 
सीधा हम जीरो वन फोर जीरो वन टू जीरो वन टू जीरो डबल टू जीरो वन सिक्स ओके जीरो जीरो नाइन ये इट्स ऑफ ओके हाँ एनीवे नौ I'll check the voltage, coil voltages. What are the voltages we are getting? Hmm. Now it is in off condition. Okay. Here two coils are there. This maybe three volts, five volts section. PL three zero one three, PL three zero two five volts. Okay. So now. No voltages. Beep. Little beep. Anyway, I'll turn on the laptop. When I'll turn on, what will be the voltage? Turn on. Five volts. Okay, I'm getting five volts when I turn on. So next second one, it's a three point three volts. Any uh, other voltages? Hmm. See, there is no voltage. I am getting is not getting high. When it's turned on, there is no RAM voltage. Okay. When it's turned on, there is no RAM voltage. No, we are getting only three uh, and five. See three point three and five volts. Yes, uh, what could be the reason? Hmm? See, this is the condition of this particular laptop motherboard. Now, when we press the power button, that time here it's showing what three point three and five volts. When we press the power button, when it is in off condition, there will be no voltages. Means here it's a I/O. This I/O, uh, when we press the power button, the time EC on is available. Because of that, we are getting three volts and five volts. Because EC on, when EC on comes, then only we will get the what three volts and five volts. Hmm? For this, we don't have schematic. But uh, anyway, let me check in general ideas. First, we need to check what in this condition we need to check RSM RST is available or not. That I will check. Hmm? First part is RSM RST with the help of compatible schematic. So I am checking this. See, this part is RSM RST. When we press the power button, no, no, without pressing power button, we are getting hmm, three point three volts. So again, I will disconnect and connect. How? Oh. We are getting 3.3 volts ECRST. Hmm? Any RSM RST? Any other reset? EC on ECRST. RST. RSM RST. Just a minute, I am checking RSM RST. Hmm. 
no there is no rsm rst here is a ecrst but ecrst is directly turning on that i really wondering here hmm. so available when i press this there will be no changes now i will check power button hmm. i'm checking compatible schematic ec kb rst one is there that we will check in number 2 when i press the power button cc kbrst that is blank so oh, it's continuous beep okay anyway i'll check power button power button here it ccrst is continuously available but when i check the kbrst ec kbrst that time it shows beep now i am checking the power button hmm. lid is available 3.3 this one is lid now i'll check power button on off on on four see i am checking on and off see the changes see the changes this one is power button dc 3 volts see the so power button is varying 3.1 volts the varying no response at all hmm? see i am turning off then also there is no response here why is giving see it's a varying hmm off on here i have doubt Hmm. RSM RST, I am getting constant one. There also there is no fluctuation. When I press the power button, here when I press the power button, for the voltage DC 2.5, it's continuously varying. Hmm. Why? 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 Hard off button. Okay, I will check power button out. When I press the power button, there is no power button out. Huh? See, in this laptop, I found something new. New in the sense here, RSM RC is constant. It's available. It has to enable and disable. but it continuously disable okay disable in the sense voltage is available in rsm rst hmm? in same thing on button also it is continuously disabled mode Ma, no actually its variation is there enable disable enable disable is going on so i suspect this pull up register may be the issue or maybe issue with the power button okay anyway Once again, I'll check the power button. Hmm. What should be the issue? I'll check the power button. Why it's not constant? Ground. The ground. DC two point two.
2.2 और प्रेस द पावर बटन टू पॉइंट टू ऑन ऑफ इट्स ओके बट इट रीचर्स आईओ देर इट्स गिविंग सम इश्यूज मैं चेक थोड़ा लिख This is the power button. Then also, no issue. See, in this case, uh, one thing is confirmed from I/O. It's not moving at all. Means RSM RST is present. No, present in the sense it is in disable mode. It has to be enable and disable, but that thing is not happening and power button is happening somehow uh i think io bias may be the issue i'll do one thing i'll do the io bias let me check now i have done the ec bias and main bias so i had little doubt in main bias so that's why i did once again but anyway let me check Hmm. I'll put original adapter. So can you a DC machine? I'll check for testing purpose. Hmm. The DC machine. DC machine. Hmm. Same reading. Okay. I'll turn it on. How? Oh, no luck. There will be LED. LED is glowing. It means three five are okay, but there is no improvement after doing the bias. <sighs> In this case, what to do? Hmm. RSM RST. Any changes in RSM RST? That I will check once again. See three point two. Hmm. After pressing power button, be in high low high position. I'm pressing the power button. Now forty seven. No improvement. Little bit improvement. Ah 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 ah. Fan came, 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 came. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, it came. See, arm bag, arm got increased. Again, I'll press power button. Yes. Check it. We would. Stop it. Hmm. It's turning on and off. Why? It's not constant. Hmm. It should be constant. This should be constant, but it's coming back to its original position. It means somewhere same issue is there. It's not bias related issue. Hmm. I will check the lid. What it will show? Lid is three point zero. Lid is okay. There is no issue with lid. Power button. I'll check. Two point 
टू पॉइंट टू टू पॉइंट टू इट्स सपोज टू बी टू पॉइंट नाइन एंड एबो एनीवे आई हैव डाउट विथ पावर बटन ओनली हम्म इट्स नॉट बायस रिलेटेड इश्यू लेट मी चेक स्लोली यस हियर हियर इट इज यूजुअली here first i'll check continuity mode i'll check yes this is the power button so i'll remove this i'm removing this so let me check If there is any short in power button, then also there will be possibilities like this. But anyway, I'll check the voltage. Mm -hmm. See, in this case, board will be okay. Ah, huh? board will be in okay condition. But without yeah, uh, without knowing anything, so some technician will damage the board. So that is a really bad thing. Please. First, you need to analyze all the things. What could be the problem? Then only you have to handle. Hmm? I'm not talking about this case, but these kind of cases, some technicians are telling, not all. See, still here it's a 2.1. Uh, in some videos, I already explained uh, in CMOS technologies and uh, what is it? One more. Hmm? You can check the video. In that detail technology, uh, there will be a voltage limit. Okay, here actually power voltage should be 2.7 usually, but here 2.1 I am getting. Hmm? Maybe that is the reason. It's unable to switch it on, turn it on. That one has come to. Where, 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 where? Ah, here. See, here is a. MOSFET or DIOD something is there. See here, it's a 2.1, 2.6, 2 2.7 on side. See, this is the voltage, main voltage. 3.2. Ah, this may be MOSFET. I think so. Here is a gate voltage, drain, and source. See, I have doubt with this particular. What is it? MOSFET. Hmm. I do one thing. I am not satisfied with this voltage. I will remove this. Let me check again. See many things we checked. So then also the amp rating was not increased. So one time it increased and it got disconnected. Right. See the matter is very simple. I am rating. It was showing double zero nine, right? When we connected the amp. See, I will show you. So now the amp rating. And there was no increase when we press the power button. Only LED was glowing and there was no improvement, right? In this case, the main suspect, the main suspect will be radio voltages. Okay, once all radio voltages are good and RSM RC also is good, then the main suspect is IO. Okay, now I replace the IO. So my suspect is correct or not? Let us check. So now I am going to press the power button. If IO was the issue, as per my knowledge, IO was the issue. If IO was the issue, then definitely this should be get on. Now already I done. Uh, I replaced the uh, this one E N E nine zero double two C C and the bias I not replaced bias program and I programmed that E N E also replaced it and reprogram. Okay. So now let me check. Now I am going to press the power button. See LED glow, and here I'm reading. Mm -hmm. No improvement. Once again, I'll press the power button. 
see now I am got increase we can add the keyboard let me check display will come or not hmm. Turn on again. Turn on. Now display may come because I am got increased. See, came success. Hmm. Once again, I will shut it down. Switch it on. See, this is second time I switch it on. So let me check the display. Once it goes to 1.4, then we will get the display. Hmm? See now, it increase again. It will restart. Once again, it will restart. I think so. Directly, display will come now. Yes, yes. One more success. Thank you. Thanks for watching.